Hello and welcome to this video on significant figures which will help you prepare for your So say we've got some results which are over this side and you want to work out the average of them. You've worked out your average, you've got the mean and these are the numbers that your calculator says. How do you know what is an appropriate number of significant figures to write down in your results table? The best way to guide it is to look at what you've written down. So if you've only used one significant figure in the results table, only use one significant figure in the average. So an appropriate result to write down for this would be six. Because you used whole numbers when you're originally writing down the results, you should use whole numbers when you're writing down your average. For this second example, You've gone to two significant figures, so I want my overall answer to two significant figures. And here we have three significant figures, so I want my final answer to three significant figures. So the significant figures are important because the more significant figures that you have, um, what you're telling me is that you've got an increase in resolution, that you can be more certain about what the exact number was. Um, if you say that it's 5.6 instead of 6, you're saying it's closer to the middle than it was to the top end. But your actual values of 5, 5 and 7, you can't be sure of that. So the more significant figures you use, you're saying there's an increase in resolution. But if you put this number in, as opposed to this number, this is a very, very specific number. It's much more detailed than this number here. It's much more detailed than the results that you started with. You cannot be certain it's this number based on these results. So always give your final average to the same number of significant figures that your results were in. And as a final point, I never want to see this symbol used. This is the recurring symbol. You use it a lot in maths. It means absolutely nothing in science. Don't use it. 